All right, I have no time to explain. Let me real quickly find warmth first. Right now, I've just got to rush to find a lava lake. Because right now, the only thing I have is a spruce sapling to keep me alive. Uh, I hate running and wasting all my hunger almost immediately, but I kind of have to find a lava pool, like, um, right now. Otherwise, it's completely game over for me. Oh my gosh, I only have 50 seconds left, dude. Oh. Um, that was perfect timing, because my grace period is almost up. If that had taken any longer, then I would have been dead. So, I'm pretty lucky I found this. So I guess right now I'm just going to go ahead and plant my spruce sapling and pretty much explain how all this works now that I'm actually, you know, safe. So pretty much I installed this temperature mod. So if I stand really close to the fire, then I start to overheat. But if I stand pretty far away from the fire, then I quickly freeze up. That's why right now I've got to find just the perfect distance to keep me the right temperature. Also, I just realized I think this tree might be a little bit too close to the lava pit. I don't want it catching on fire. Alright, there we go. That might be a little bit better. So yeah, anyways, recently I watched this YouTube video about surviving Minecraft's hottest mod. And it was a really good video, you should definitely check it out. But in my head, I thought, wait, why not I go ahead and try to do Minecraft's coldest mod instead? So yeah, this video is heavily inspired off of that. And also, if you're wondering why I have a spruce sapling, and you might think, hey wait, that's cheating, it's actually not, because... Trees are impossible to spawn in ice spice biomes. Meaning if I ever wanted to have a chance of wood, then I would kind of have to give myself at least one sapling. And I don't want to hear you guys talking about like wandering traders or whatever. No, I'm not doing that. I ain't doing all that. But anyways, I guess before the night falls, I might as well just build myself a tiny little shelter. And it won't really be that great because it's going to be like pretty much made out of dirt because that's kind of the only thing I can collect right now. Alright, you know what? This will do for now. It's close enough to the lava pit to where I'll actually be safe. But yeah, pretty much until this tree grows, I can't really do anything. So yeah, I guess this is going to be a lot of waiting now. Wait, trees can grow in ice box bombs, right? I'm not being an idiot right now, right? <laughs> oh yeah, one more thing. This is in hardcore mode, so I really have to be careful. And also, I have to be very conservative with my hunger, because I wasted it a lot in the start trying to find this lava pit. But now, I genuinely cannot afford to lose another hunger bar, because I have a feeling we're going to go a long time without food. It's funny how usually in most scenarios, water is the source of life, but in this scenario, it's actually lava that's keeping me alive. So, uh, yeah, pretty funny. But anyways, the sun is setting, so I'm just going to go ahead and block myself off for the night, so I'll see you in the morning. Holy cow, I was not expecting it to- <laughs> I was not expecting it to be that dark. What was that? I think I just heard a skeleton. Yep, that's a skeleton. Okay. Oh, shh. Shoot. Okay. Well, um, yeah, strays are definitely something that's going to be a problem. Um, you know what? I'm going to go ahead. Maybe I can get some bones. Come on. I'm right here. Okay. Come on. Look at me. Oh, shoot. Okay. I've got to play this very safe. If I can get bones, then getting bone meal is going to speed this up a lot faster. Dude, it's so difficult getting a stray to aggro on me because I don't want to die. Where did it even go? Oh, there it is. Come on. Yeah, come here. Hey, come here. You. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Yes, come on. Oh, sh Dude, come on. You're my- ah -ha! There we go. Oh my gosh. Okay. I almost lost my hardcore world. Like, immediately. What the heck? <laughs> and he... Bruh! He didn't even drop any bones. Alright, so I was kind of a dumbass in this recording. Um, for some reason I forgot that strays <laughs> burn in the sun anyways. So, I really did just try and kill one and risk my entire world. Because I'm an idiot. Oh, wait, dude, I'm an idiot. I just realized the sun's gonna kill them anyways. Why Why did I have the need to try and kill that stray? There's there's no reason. They're gonna die anyway. 
Oh, I made the advancement huddle close. That's nice. Anyways, the most important thing is my tree actually grew. I didn't even need bone meal or anything. Okay. Oh, oops. Okay. Okay. Uh, um, um, I, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Yes. Okay. Wait. Okay. Yes. That's two saplings. That's two saplings. Okay. Some sticks are also nice. Wait, if I can get a four sapling, that's going to be huge. Unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to get a four sapling. But you know what? That's all right. I'll still take my three saplings. No complaining. But now I officially have wood, which means boom, a crafting table. That was the slowest crafting table I've ever made. That's great. Cause now I can actually start doing the basic things of Minecraft. There we go. Very nice. Oh, nice. We found coal already. And what, why is there, what does that mean? Why is there like glowing on the side? That's uh, interesting. I don't know why that's there. Oh shoot, I'm gonna quickly find like some rabbits maybe I can kill so I can at least get some of my hunger up. So uh, any any rabbits? Uh, great, okay, the night's already, already coming. All right, that's great. Looks like there's no food. It's not gonna be another hungry night. <laughs> But the good thing is, I can actually, you know, collect stone and all that while I'm at it. Unfortunately, it's going to be a little bit dark for y'all for quite a bit, because uh, I kind of don't really have uh, any light right now. Oh, I just realized I probably can actually make torches. I'm such an idiot. There we go. Now y'all can actually see. Dude, how have I not found iron yet? This is ridiculous. One good thing I do notice about being underground is your temperature pretty much stays the same, which is pretty nice. Oh, okay. Well, I hear zombies. That's not good, actually. I'm actually trying to avoid caves right now because this is kind of like my first time ever playing hardcore. And uh, I cannot afford to die. And so caves are kind of a dead zone for me. Oh my gosh, these mob sounds are so loud. Okay. Um. Oh, wow. Okay, wait, that's a dungeon. That's why I keep hearing so much. Wait, hang on. This could actually be good right now. Because I can actually get rotten flesh and I can get my hunger back up. Oh, sh- Gosh, bro. Holy, holy cow. Holy cow. Holy cow, holy cow, holy cow, holy cow, holy cow, holy cow, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I think I just pissed my pants. Oh my god. Well, that was almost the end of my recording. Um, wow. Um, <laughs> great. Uh, I'm probably just gonna have to attack them from up high, so that... You know, doesn't happen again. Yep, I hear a baby zombie. Yeah, I need to make sure I stand back far enough to where they don't kill me. Because any hit from them right now would literally be the end. In a second, I'm actually going to get rid of that uh, spawner. So I can actually, you know, collect the food. Actually, wait, this is kind of good for XP. Oh, okay, there's one with chainmail. Alright, you know what? Screw the XP. Right now, I'm just gonna get rid of that spawner. I just need the food, dude. Okay. Let me be careful here. Okay, and there goes my pick. Okay. Oof, I got rid of it. Alright. Nice. Okay. Uh. There we go. Alright, 28... Rotten flesh. Oh wait, hey, I just realized I got potatoes. That's actually really good. And also there's two chests that I am still yet to explore, but right now I just want to get the full hunger before I check. And look at that health being restored. That's what I'm talking about. I just realized, aside from that baby zombie, I probably couldn't have asked for a better solution to my hunger. Cause hunting rabbits is like super frustrating. Alright, I need to make sure that everywhere is clear from here, so I'm just going to block off these two inches. Alright, let's see what's in these chests. 
a uh, wheat which is good bane of anthropods <laughs> four interesting got some bones some string which is nice and an iron ingot oh yeah an iron horse armor although i forgot cave noises were a thing oh i just found a name tag that's nice and while i'm at it i'm gonna go ahead and collect these chests too all right i'm just gonna go ahead and go back up to the surface where i can get some more wood and maybe start a farm i am kind of disappointed that it's wheat and not seeds because i can't really plant wheat but i'll take the potatoes for sure all right is everything clear all right i think it is Right now, I'm pretty much just doing the most basic upgrade to my shelter. And, you know what, let's go ahead and get a door here, too. Alright, there we go. This is our very first farm. Um, I hope it's not too close to the lava, and also not, like, too far away. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and move it one over. I'm a little scared it's gonna burn. Or maybe I'm an idiot, and maybe crops can't actually burn like that. Alright, anyways, this is my humble abode, um... <laughs> um, please ignore the looks, it's under renovation, um, but, you know, we got a little, you know, home, we got, uh, we got our little mine down here, you know, we got a little, little, I don't know what this is, hallway, oh wait, I, we have two mines, I don't, I'm, okay, I'm confused. Alright, that's the short mine, so I'm gonna cover that one up, and this is the actual mine right here. I should probably go get sand so I can have a little window so I can tell the time, but oh well. I'm pretty much just gonna go back to mining because uh, that's kind of like the only important thing to me right now. And back into the mines we go. Alright, now I said I wouldn't go into any caves, but I'm actually kind of curious to see if there's any possible iron around here. Oh boy, okay. Uh, oh, there's iron. Alright, that's nice. Dude, I'm so paranoid of a mob, like, just coming up and surprise attacking me, dude. Oh, there's more iron right there. Okay, that's nice. I hear water, so... Unfortunately, I don't have a bucket yet, but that will be important later. Alright, so I'm pretty sure this is mob-free now, so, uh, should be good to just mine all this ore. And you know what? I never mine copper, but I might as well just take whatever I can get now. Alright, let's go ahead and mine this iron. It's about time. Holy cow, dude, that... <laughs> dude, I swear, pickaxe breaking always gets you every single time. It's like a jump scare. Oh, dude, wait! I'm an idiot! I just realized I could have crafted a shield, like, when I first got this iron. I'm such a... Oh my gosh, I'm such a moron. There we go, we got a furnace. This is our first sign of, like, non-natural warmth. And it, it, it doesn't Bruh. really, I, it doesn't seem, okay, it, I don't think it, it's working. Wait, really? None of the, okay, none of the saplings have grown up. You know what, I'm just gonna go ahead and use my bone meal. Oh, shoot! Okay, wow. I am so glad I noticed that. Okay. Uh, <gasps> whew. Dude, that creeper is a huge um, booty hole. That creeper is a huge booty hole. Um, you know what? My content's not exactly family friendly, but um, I might as well at least try to stay on YouTube's good side. All right. I got me a bucket, and this is going to be good because I need to get water, which there's some right here. There we go. Now I am aware that water does freeze in the cold, and so this farm eventually won't work. However, uh, I'm pretty sure if you place trapdoors, if I'm correct, I think it should be fine. Or is it fences? It might be fences. Okay, yeah, it is fences. Oh, wait. Bruh. Okay, so you're telling me there has been iron just right here this whole time. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and use bone meal, because I don't know why these trees aren't go- Okay, well. Boom, there's four. Okay, nice. Now, we can go ahead and we'll bam Alright, anyways, back to the mines I go. 
The children yearn for the mine. I just realized I never checked out this side of the cave. Let's see what's over here. <laughs> okay. Alright, well, there's nothing really else in this cave, so I'm just gonna go ahead and continue strip mining. Okay, that's water. Bruh. Oh, never mind, that's... Why did that appear blue to me? Either way, this is a cave, and that's a creeper right there, which is fun. Hey, little bro. Everybody can poke his little toes. Come here. Yeah, what are you gonna do about it? Oh. Oh, this could be a big cave over here. Uh, I do not think I'm ready to go searching through that cave yet, because I want to at least make sure I have iron armor first. Even though I do have a shield, I'm still very paranoid, because this is on hardcore. Anyways, that's a pretty neat find. I'm actually going to save this for when I'm not such a pussy. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and try and get these trees to grow. There we go. Awesome. Wow. Alright, we uh, never ever officially run out of wood. Wait, hang on. It is. Oh my gosh. Bro. Oh, dude. <laughs> I'm gonna cry, bro. <laughs> There's just something about, like, the older you get, the more this music just hits, bro. I actually have no idea if this music's copyrighted, so. Oh my word, it's snowing. Oh my gosh. This just hits even harder, dude. I mean,. Okay, ignoring- uh, Can this hunger thing go away? I'm trying to get a good shot here, dude. Why did it go so dark? Wait, what? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. This is- That's a very good shot right there. You know what? At this point, if I want iron armor, I'm just gonna have to man up. Come on. I can go into this cave. I know I can do it. I can get the iron. I can get the iron. These mobs ain't gonna be a threat to me. Nuh-uh. No. They aren't going to be a threat. I ain't no wimp. Come on. Wait, is that zombie villager? Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. Uh, you... Hang on, wait. Actually, this could be big. Alright, I'm going to want this zombie villager trapped in a boat. Because he's going to be useful later. Alright. No, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Don't... Uh, I didn't mean to suffocate you, my fault G, because you're, you're gonna be useful later in this world, because, uh, villagers don't spawn in this, this biome, so. Oh my! Oh. Oh my. Dude. <laughs> Why? I hate this game so much sometimes. Once again, that could have absolutely have been the end of my hardcore world right there. Oh, here's water. Dude, I wish water wasn't so hard to see. Okay, this cave kind of sucks booty, I ain't gonna lie. Dude, why do I never bring a crafting table with me, dude? You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and make an iron pick, cause... You know what? Why not? I've got balls. Oh, here we go, we got deep slate. Okay, this is another cave. Oh, and there's water too. Wait, I just realized there's this water cave up here. I will take this magma block and see if there's anything around me. It is very- <laughs> It is very hard to see. Oh, okay. This gets pretty deep. Okay, wow, I'm overheating. What on earth? Holy cow. Holy. I did not notice how hot I was getting. That's right, at this point I'm gonna find diamonds before I find more iron. Wait, is this iron? It is, finally. Finally I found more iron. I have no idea why that took me so long. Okay, how am I gonna get past this without burning myself? 
And if I really quickly go past it, there we go. We're fine. Okay, this is a big cave. Uh, I'm surprised there are no mobs that are swarming me right now. <laughs> Dang, I need, I need a little bit more iron for full iron. Okay, I'm gonna have to do some, some tricks. Alright, that cave I'll explore another time. Because for now, I think... Oh! Well, nice job, team. Um, I was just about to say I gotta go back up, but... Um, uh, I just found diamonds, and it's more than one. <laughs> Neat. I'll most definitely take it. And now the long, treacherous journey all the way back. Uh, dude, I'm gonna have to put in some stairs here. One more thing I want to do before this video ends, and that's actually make a good shelter. You know, one that doesn't look like this. Alright, this seems to be good. Uh, let's go ahead and actually get our first baked potato. Because I think it's about time we stop eating the stupid rotten flesh as our food. And also, I just realized I've still had this for wheat from the very beginning. So, look at that. I know my hunger's like barely any, but... Oh, isn't that nice. Not having that stupid hunger thing. <laughs> And nice. Now I'm going to feel a lot more protected going down. That doesn't mean that I'm 100% safe, but it does mean I'm definitely a lot less likely to get killed. All right, here we go with the music again. Wow. Dude, I know I'm over obsessing with shaders, but Come on, bro. This is just, this is just so beautiful. I mean, I know this is only the ice spikes biome, but I feel like that alone just makes this so much more pretty. Why did I just craft another axe? Well, I, I'm actually a dumbass, dude. Why? Why? <laughs> I meant to craft another pickaxe, but, uh, I... Okay, well, um... Yeah, alright. <laughs> now I know I have a spare. Boom, ba doom ba doom Boom, ba ba There we go. We finally got all the stairs placed in. Okay, now, finally, I think we can begin uh, building our little igloo thing. Also, that is a very pretty looking spruce tree. I like it. But yeah, first thing first, let's get rid of this cobblestone because it's really ugly. Oh. Well, uh, so there's another zombie villager. Okay, don't... Don't kill my zombie villager, please. Okay, you can now get in that boat. Come on. There you go. Alright, nice. I have a zombie villager. This is my second zombie villager, which is actually really good. The fact that I already have these. Now... Uh, hopefully in the future I'll be able to find a witch of some sort, and then I can actually have villagers in my world, which would be really cool. Okay, dude, I only need two more string, and then I can make a bed, which is gonna be huge. Alright, so, I think I'm planning on building my base, like, right about here. So, uh, I am going to have to get rid of these ice spikes. Dude, I'm surprised. I haven't seen, like, a single stray, like, since that first night, which is kind of weird to me. I don't know why I haven't been able to find them. Like, even right now, they should be, like, around. But for some reason, they're not. 
Oh wow, that is... That's a very pretty shade of blue, I ain't gonna lie. Oops. Dude, oh my, there's no way I just did that twice. I tried crouching and it didn't. Right. Uh, so this is the first time I've ever had to deal with these guys. Uh, so I think I'm just gonna hide under here. Dude, why is this blue so pretty? Like, the way the light reflects off of this ice is just so beautiful looking. Is that just me? Like, I swear. Ooh! Oh, that was smooth. I had like the perfect amount. Oh, wow. That was satisfying. Alright, now I'm just gonna clear this area of all the rest of the snow. Because I just want a flat dirt base. Alright, and while this phantom tries to kill me, um, I'm gonna go ahead and just start the foundation for this little igloo house. So we're gonna kind of go one, two... Whoa, can you shut up? And we'll have the front door. Two. Dog. Bo Bo can't hit me because he keeps getting stuck on the tree, bro. Oh, oh my gosh, bro. There we go. Golly, bro. Trying to build my house here, dog. No, not again, bro. Oh, you've got to be. There's two of you, bro. Oh my god. And then I can build up the walls like this. Alright, nice. This is a little cozy. I mean, I do need like actual windows, but uh... I do like how it is so far. Did I just get... I just got a poisonous potato. Um, I know that's like the most useless item in the game, but uh... You know what? I'll get an item from him and I'll frame it to the wall. I, I just got a second one! <laughs> what are the odds? There we go. Little doorbell. Now, obviously, this igloo isn't actually going to keep me warm. But I do plan on adding, like, some swarm of heat, uh, maybe later in the next episode. But, uh, right now, I ain't doing all that. But yeah, that's pretty much just gonna be it for today. Um, I got my little igloo, you know, I got a lot of things set up in this video. Um, this is all, like, one recording, by the way. This is not, like, multiple days. I've been playing this for, like, the last, like, four hours. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, turn on the bell notification, and I'll...